Okay, guys, we're back. Um, <clears throat> well, I took the bait, and I uh, pulled the trigger on another IYV from Amazon. So, aside from this nasty hole in the box, uh, this is never a good sign. This is not a good way to start a relationship. Take a look and see what we get. It's always a mystery. You never know. Okay, so let's go with the uh, typical unveiling of this thing. Again, you know, it kills me with IYV because they ship them in these boxes. I just tore the thing by moving the edge. Hopefully the guitar doesn't have a, uh, a big gash in it due to this thing here. My reviews are always interesting. I, I haven't seen down here yet, although there is a little tear. And the squeaking is driving me crazy. First impression, meet my new girlfriend. Right then, isn't it a beaut- I had to wear black to celebrate black. I think I'm going to nickname this guitar Licorice because it looks like this was under $200, I believe. Like, I don't know what they're doing over there. Better off not knowing. First thing I want to talk about here is the finish. This is an absolutely beautiful, smoky, sort of a gray burst, gray to a black, with a really beautiful tiger stripe on the top. We've got two humbucker pickups here, which I've had no problem with these stock pickups. I'm a stock guy. Diamond head knob here for the volume and a diamond head knob for the tone. Three-way selector switch, which feels a little loose. It's a little easy to pop. Now the one thing I want to point out here guys which is extremely cool is it string through body and it's staggered here on the back end. Standard bridge, uh, tunematic style, basically it's got that PRS style headstock which is also really nice with the IYV inlay with mother of pearl. Fairly straight, it needs a little tweaking. Let's fire this bad boy up see how it sounds. Shall we? Let's. Definitely not in tune, unless it's some sort of funky Dave Matthews style of tuning. I don't know. I, as I was tuning this up, guys, I want to make a comment. Uh, some of the gears here were a little sticky. Some of them were a little loose. Again, beggars can't be choosers. It's got a nice little, little rock sound there. Reaction's a little, a little weird, but probably do a truss adjustment, which is a real simple thing because, like I said, the the neck looks like it has a little relief in it. I'm going to sort of flatten it. Here's out. our rhythm pickup. A little too much reverb there. I sound like I'm playing in the Grand Canyon. Our treble pickup, and then I go to the middle. I never mess with the middle pickup, but I will for you guys. Soup. It feels like there's some sort of a, uh, maybe a, a mid-cut, or either that, or maybe sort of a semi-out-of-phase thing. It's, I don't know if it was done intentionally, or, but it's, it's kind of cool. Nice thumpy sound to it. Let's get rid of this plastic thing, shall we, off the pickup? The pickup. Protectors, be gone. Full game? Let's see how it sounds. Rhythm pickup? gem to be had on Amazon. Gorgeous finish, strings through body, diamond head knobs, humbucker pickups, uh, three-way selector switch. Really, really, really nice. And guys, they're on Amazon, so you can, if you don't dig it, you can return it. I'm going to have to go live with this thing and terrorize some people locally in the clubs before I go and do a little slide demo on this bad boy. <laughs> This 
might become my new uh, new slide guitar for live gigs. Anyway, guys, have a great weekend. Go do something good for somebody. Have fun while you're doing it. Check out this beautiful PRS style IYB guitar on Amazon. Rock on, brothers.